Good morning, welcome back to my channel. I've really, really missed vlogging. I haven't posted something in, I think, a few weeks, but I really, really want to get back into it. Um, I'm also talking to you before I've even had a sip of my coffee, which is very, very to the brim. <clears throat> These chocolate um, Nespresso pods from, I think they're from Target. They look like this. They're so good. Highly recommend them. They're not Nespresso brand, but they're really good. Um, okay, I'm gonna bring you guys over here so that we can do a little life update chat. I haven't vlogged in a really long time. The last time I vlogged was the weekend in Newport, which was I think like one of the first weekends of April or like middle of April. Anyways, um, so yeah, I just have been really craving wanting to pick up the camera and just start vlogging again. Kind of a lot of life updates coming up that I feel like I should just get out in the open. It's not like it's like a big deal. It's just like normal life updates, but um, there's a lot of crap behind me because I've been collecting things because I'm moving in with Brian in the summer at some point and Caitlin and Jacqueline are moving as well and they're gonna just be right down the street. They got an apartment, so I'm really excited about that. Very happy for them. It's also Mother's Day weekend this weekend my sister is having her baby on Monday, so I'm so, so excited. I seriously cannot believe it. My niece just turned two, two days ago. So life is just moving really fast and it's actually crazy to think that Caitlin, Jacqueline and I moved in here in 2018 and now it's 2023. The time has just gone by so fast and it's insane and I'm so grateful for the time that we spent here. It's been the best apartment ever. We definitely have like a weird connection with this apartment because we, when they got their apartment, we definitely were like, oh my God, it's real, it's setting in. You know, like when, when you've been in the same place for such a long time, it's like, it really does feel like home. So, but it's time, we're ready. It'll be hard to let go of, but we're very excited. I think I'm gonna go home this weekend on Saturday. Brian's in Arizona for Corey's 30th birthday this weekend. Um, so I think I might go home and just spend some time with my mom. We have plans for Sunday for Mother's Day, which maybe I will vlog because it's in a really cute town in Maine. It's like a outlet shopping town. So I'll probably vlog that and um, we're going to the Sox game again tonight, so that'll be fun. It was supposed to be sunny out today, but it's not, and I don't have my phone with me. So I hope the sun does pop out. Things start to get really exciting for the summer. This 4th of July will be a year since I started vlogging, which also going back to timing is crazy because it's been, <laughs> it feels like I started vlogging like two days ago, but last summer was really fun. Our, we have really fun summers just as a group all together. Our friends really, really take advantage of the New England weather, so. I'll start vlogging this summer and that'll be great. And end of summer, we are going to Europe again for my friend Sophie's wedding. And that is me, Kimmy, Jacqueline, Caitlin, and Brian. And we're hitting all the spots. We're doing London, Rome, Florence, Tuscany, Siena, Sorrento, Positano, Paris, it's gonna be crazy. I'm so excited that like I have this camera so that I can still vlog everything because to this day I still go back and I look at me and Brian's vlogs, well, my vlogs of Brian and I's trip from Spain. So I'm so excited that I have this as my little diary and it's gonna be really, really fun. And then a month after that is his brother's wedding in Tennessee. Just to make your mystery clear. I'm gonna 
have for my breakfast and lunch because it's like 11.30 right now. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Um, I found another box downstairs. So I'm nowhere close to done. I don't even know where all this stuff comes from. Like, all this clothes. <laughs> mm. Oh my God, it's my dress that I wore to Chelsea's wedding. So cute. I actually think I'm gonna bring this to uh, Nashville and like wear it with cowboy boots and a jean jacket. I think that would be so cute. Um, selling this. There's just a lot in here that I'm gonna have to weed through, but it's a, it's a later problem. It's not a problem for right now because I need to get ready to go. It is stunning. It feels like a beach day. It is so nice out. So funny, Brian's in Arizona and it is 88 degrees here right now. I think it's like 100 there, but still. It's nice out as he leaves. Oh my God, it's gorgeous. I cannot wait for summer. It's happening. Stuck like this permanently. Say hi, girls. Hello. Happy summer. To the side. We're on our way to the Red Sox game. Um, last time you saw us, we were actually there, but now we have Jacqueline. one o'clock now so it's not even morning but I am gonna pop into Trader Joe's to go get my mom some flowers for Mother's Day two days I think I've actually spoken to the camera but it is 6 30 on Sunday it's actually Mother's Day we went to up to Kittery Maine for lunch and then we popped into a few stores because there's like an outlet um, there so I went to Crate and Barrel Lululemon all that stuff I actually I'll show you guys what I got when I get home because I'm heading back now to my apartment um, Caitlin and I stayed at my parents house to watch the Celtics and we won and I'm so excited and I'm so happy that means we're going to the championships and we are playing Miami Heat so I'm so excited to watch that I think it's on Wednesday so hopefully fingers crossed we make it through but yeah it was a really nice day it was a little bit colder today than it was um, the last two days it was like high 80s and today was um, like low 70s, but it was still nice. It was sunny, so that works for me. Now I have 40 minutes home, so probably gonna listen to a podcast or listen to music or something and just put the windows down. And then I'm gonna edit this when I get home. Well, I'll show you my stuff from Lululemon when I get home, and then I will edit this and get it up. I just got home and I was putting away a few things and cleaning up, but I mentioned the Modern Relic sale that I went to a few weekends ago and I bought these pillow covers. They were $174 and I got them for 40 bucks. 
Um, and I just bought the pillow inserts from Crate and Barrel and I am obsessed with them. I think they're so pretty. This is the back, so if I ever wanted to like change it up a little bit and have like a linen moment, I think that's really cute. Sorry, I'm like out of breath. Whew. Um, but yeah, I think they're so cute. They look really good on my bed, obviously once it's like all made. And then I went to Lululemon, the outlet, so I will show you guys what I got. I was feeling an orange moment. I feel like these are kind of coming up red on camera, but they are orange. I got these jogger shorts that have the lining in them. I've always wanted a pair of these and I've never had them before, so I'm excited to try those out. And then I got this long sleeve shirt, which is also orange and cute. This was, uh, where's the tag? There it is. Uh, this is the Classic Fit Cotton Blend Long Sleeve. It was 68 and I got it for 49 And then these shorts were 88 that I got for 49 as well. And then I already have a pair of these joggers. These are the Dance Studio joggers. I have them in green. I actually got them last Mother's Day when I went up to Kittery. And I'm obsessed with them. I'm so glad I got them. So I got them in this like rusty orange color. Love those. And then I just picked up a pair of pants for Brian because I feel like these will be good for like traveling when we go to Europe and they're just, I thought they were cute. I like that they have this little zip at the bottom. They're just like a green gray color. All right, I'm feeling so dirty and disgusting so I'm going to take a shower. Jacqueline's picking up sushi for us for dinner. 